G'day folks, how's it going? It's Raven here and welcome to the Crikey Lounge. I have to say that it has been a very busy month of February already and I feel a little bit exhausted to tell you the truth. And I have to admit though, it's been a very busy month of February to begin with. First and foremost, um, thank you so much everybody for the wonderful moments of my streams this month this has been a blessing in disguise first and foremost check this out my new emblem from world of warships uh, for celebrating has been a cc for world of warships for two years and it doesn't feel like it to tell you the truth i have to say but when i was looking at reviewing uh, my streams and everything beforehand yeah i have been a cc for two years in world of warships and it has been an interesting joyride uh, for being a community contributor for World of Warships, to tell you the truth. I know that I have been through a lot of highs and lows in the past, you know, 24 months, but everyone goes through that and it has been pretty full on. But the biggest thing I can say, folks, is that we have learned a lot and at the same time we have hang in there and made a lot of big differences, to tell you the truth. Um, first and foremost, the biggest thing that I can say when I been in the CC for World of Warships two years ago was that I remembered when Bogsy uh, came on my stream and asked me to join the CC program and I was very, very proud and I was very, very happy. It was the biggest, uh, <laughs> you know, moment of my life. It was really glad to be part of the CC program. I was invited in the family and I was welcomed with open arms. I have to admit though that it was actually a bit of an interesting reception when I got into the program. Um, there's a lot of people out there that was very, very happy to see me. And at the same time, there were some people that weren't happy to see me, but it's okay, it happens with everyone. Um, but you know, the funny thing about it all was that I've learned a lot about at all when I had started joining the CC program and I have found a lot of things. Uh, that was actually pretty damn interesting, I have to tell you the truth. Um, some of the experiences that I have shared in there has been definitely the definition of a wild ride. And some of it was definitely a wild card, I have to admit. Um, some of the things in there, I just could not believe what I was dealing with, but it was just like a funny experience that, you know, people are being people. And that's the biggest thing about it all, that people are being people, that you will have people that do get along with you and people who don't. But I don't have many issues with anyone as such. But the funny thing is that I do have funny what if moments and what the F moments is about Wargaming's decision making sometimes. But I have to say that it's probably best, you know, like you just sit at the back behind the lines and just enjoy the show and you go like, you know what, man, that sounds great. Oh, that sounds horrible. But you know, at the same time, you just like think about it all. You know what, being a CC for World of Warships isn't too bad after all. And the, the biggest funny thing about it all is you folks out there. Now, what what made a difference in my stream and community is this. Folks, first and foremost, I cannot express how grateful, how much gratitude or how much thanks and appreciation I can give back to you for what you've done. But, you know, simply thank you, everybody. You have been incredible i mean like i have never have had that experience in a very long time i sorry i'm just a bit emotional right now but it was a very um full-on journey for me because Back in 2015, I don't know many people um, have heard this story, but I know that some of you have, and I will just share the story real quick in summary. Um, my best mate from high school, primary school, that I've known for at least 23 years or so, he um, passed away at the young age of 
32 back in 2015. Now, I have to admit that death, uh, that tragedy in my life was a shock in my system and everything that happened to me, both physically, mentally and spiritually as well too, as a person. And it really tore me up. And it's and I want to start off by saying that uh, today I feel released. I feel very much released because of you all. And I just want to start off by saying that thank you so much for bringing that love, appreciation, the joy, the happiness back in my heart. It has, well, I have to admit, without the word of a lie here, the other day I actually broke down and cried and I was feeling like I was freed and I was very, very happy. Um, and I had been battling this depression for quite some time. I have to admit though that, um, you know, my best mate's passing was a huge shock to me because when he passed away two days after my birthday in February in 2015, nine years ago, I did not know what to say or what to do. It was just basically a huge shock in the system, as I was saying. And I was just really, really sad about losing a great friend, a great mate, a brother, or someone who I considered his family. And I did not know what to say or what to do at the time. And the funny thing about this story, folks, is that when I was trying to figure out what to say, what to do, you know, like on the stream that we have been doing, I just want to say again, thank you so much for making me feel so much loved and appreciated. There's a lot of things I will admit, I will have to say with you all that there's a lot of things that made me feel so much better knowing you that you have made me feel more like at home. You know, it's good to have great friends, people I can talk to and enjoy my social time, my social life with you all and just have fun gaming and streaming at the same time. I had never expected to get this far at all. And I have to admit though that my journey to Twitch Partner is looking good so far and I hope it keeps going out the direction to tell you the truth. Um, but I just want to start off with saying thanks to a few people here in this video. First and foremost, I just want to acknowledge and say thanks to a lot of people in my four years of streaming on Twitch and two years being a CC for World of Warships. I want to reach out and say thanks to the following. TC Freya, Chaos Machine, Sony MG. Those three people at the beginning were mostly the well-driven people behind the scenes who have been very proactive introducing me to different people and communities out there. I got to know um, a lot of different people out there as well and very famous people I have to say. For example, I Chase Gaming. I Chase Gaming, thank you so much for being a good friend to me as well. Also, a supporter of the channel. And I just want to start off by reaching out to other people like C Raptor, Lord Zaff, um, Mini Hannibal, Wookie Legend, uh, Bogsy, Bogsy Time. <laughs> Bogsy is a funny one, folks. I mean, I have to say, Bogsy is a very funny one because he's now a community manager for World of Warships, as you know. And he's a funny bloke, very good at heart, and his heart's in the right place always. Ash Kantz as well. Um, Gaishu, Conception, Legionnaire. Uh, the Wargaming team, generally speaking. But there's one person who's no longer on the Wargaming team now, but I do miss, and I have always loved and appreciated, and that was Murray Draco. Murray Draco has done a lot in the community for World of Warships as such, and 
he will always be loved and respected and forever missed he is a wonderful bro bloke all around i have actually had nothing but great things to say thing about him because he has done a lot for us you know to tell you the truth i have to admit i was a bit shocked um when he uh left the wargaming team and i was surprised about what happened to tell you the truth and honestly i'm just glad that well in all different in all you know differences aside i'm just glad he's okay and that's the main thing i do miss him i think he's a wonderful bloke all around i do think it's uh kind of funny in a way that we used to sit back and relax and talk a lot of things but you know i have to admit that it's a bit uh mind-blowing experience knowing that he's gone now around not longer the in the war game his team so whatever you're doing my draco i wish you well and all the best and thank you for your generosity for the stuff that you have done in this community and you will always be remembered for that there's a lot of things you have done for us in the world of warships community because well first of all most we got you know there's brazilian ships that we gave away to people and it was great <laughs> it was marvelous it was a great experience and you know like you were very helpful in helping me towards my stream and giveaways um in towards you know um my birthday streams and stuff and thanks again again thank you so much but yeah look I will admit though, folks, I mean, like, there have been some people I haven't got along with that well, but, you know, like, in all seriousness, though, they have done a lot for me as well, and I do acknowledge and thank them as well, too. But there's one thing I want to say is that I, I don't know where to begin, but I'm very, very humbled and thankful to have met you all, lovely people out there. You have made a, an incredible difference in my life. You really have. It has been quite an inspiration. It has been something that has been in the making for quite some time. First and foremost, four years on Twitch. I had never seen myself in streaming for that so long. It feels like I would only, was doing it only tomorrow. But at the same time though, that uh, being two years of being a CC for World of Warships, and again, that's been full on. And, you know, it is all thanks to this lovely guy here, uh, my best mate and who has passed away, uh, Tony and his legacy. Tony and his legacy, generally speaking, it is a bit of a big legacy in his own right, was that the one thing he did encourage me to do before he passed away was that to make as many friends and build up a good you know platform or something that will make me feel loved and appreciated and enjoyed and to be honest with you i have think i have found it i really have and i just want to start off by saying thanks to everyone out there for making this possible and making me smile bringing the love the joy the passion everything in back of my life i feel like the chains have been lifted off my heart and my mind and i feel like i'm free again and you know like i know that my best mate is in heaven right now and i do miss him i'm not gonna lie about it i really do miss good people like that in my life and it was taken too soon but in going forward it's not the end of the road because i do have a lot of potential out there for you folks out there and i just want to enjoy that time with you all it has been such an emotional journey in my streaming life and i really hope i do get twitch partner this year uh, for 2024 i definitely have seen the viewership numbers is looking phenomenally great right now and i think it's only a matter of if and when 
So I'm fingers crossed, you know, like I've got my fingers crossed for it all right now. And, you know, like we've got a good community behind us and that's the biggest difference right now. And we've got a, biggest com a big community right behind us and we are definitely making uh, a great journey in this together. I will admit though that everything that you have been doing, folks, has been quite inspirational. I have nothing but great things to say about you all. You know, when I had uh, some friends of mine from work or different places I have, you know, hanging around with, uh, with people and stuff like that, they all say like, you know, you're doing a great job. You know, you're doing a great job and it does look like everything's going well for you. I hope you're, you know, feeling okay and stuff. Well, to be honest, in my back of my mind, I know that, you know, like, I know that in terms of the face of it all, when I'm looking at you and everything, I know that I'm enjoying my time. But at the same time, deep down, I, I'm very, very happy knowing that I have met you all and I have made great friends. And that has made the difference in my life today. I cannot express my gratitude, my thanks more than enough except by doing it tenfold with my actions but anyways folks i just want to start off by saying that before i head off tonight again folks thank you so much for your incredible support it has been greatly appreciated there's nothing i can express that brings my gratitude towards you all except you know just maintain good vibes being myself and having a wonderful time with you all and being a cc for world of warships for two years i'm looking forward to onwards and upwards anyways and looking forward for many years yet to come but that is pretty much it i mean like i'm really really enjoying myself and yeah i'm just enjoying myself a lot i really am I really am. But for now, folks, I'm going to call it a night here. And I'm winding up. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for the four wonderful years on Twitch. And looking forward to streaming more and more in the future. And also, thank you so much for the two years celebration as well. Looking forward to the third year in 2025. I hope maybe with fingers crossed here that i could have five good reasons to celebrate next year but yeah i just you know want to you know just go with the flow and see how we go all right folks stay safe take care folks and definitely we'll see you around in the next uh, croaky lounge episode but until then have a good week and have a good time with family and friends and whatever you're doing definitely just enjoy life to the full that is my best advice in this video thanks again everybody <laughs>